Hi, I'm Kristen of Case Co Arts, and today we will be working on this 12 by 16 canvas using a plethora of different colors. Uh, we will be doing another balloon smash. Yes, I'm keeping the balloon smash or slash balloon kiss uh, thing going. So I would like for you guys to join me and pay attention on another adventure with Case Co Arts on this canvas. Okay, so the colors that I have picked out for today, the background color is going to be a uh, straight Prussian blue. And this time I'm gonna get the consistency of the paint thin enough on here. I'll make sure that it's a thin, very thin layer. So let's go ahead and start. is a pretty thin layer and this is my regular acrylic pouring medium that I added to this canvas well to this color so hopefully this turns out the way that I want it to it's not too thin not too thick this is an opaque color so Gotta be careful with the sides, making sure that they are good and covered. So I have the colors on there. I have the Prussian blue on here. And Prussian blue, it dries very, very dark. I'm gonna try to see if I can blow out a little bit more. I don't have it too thick in certain areas. Okay. Okay, so I have, again, the Prussian blue blown out. And I want to try to go with the colors that we did last time. And I might add some clonacridone magenta in there. And I did want to add some of my fluorescent colors. So we're just going to go with the flow. You guys know I never have things completely planned out. So work with me. Okay, so for the first balloon smash, I am going to put it right here. Just a little bit of each color. So I have the phthalo green, bright aqua green mix. I have the Prussian blue slash red mix. I have the Prussian blue slash white mix. I have the cadmium yellow. And we're doing it down this way just to be safe. <laughs> Okay, so for right now, those are the only colors that I'm going to add in. And I'm going to take my small balloon right here and try to do the balloon smash. So here we go. Should I do this? my canvas apron this time to wipe it off then go back right here okay I'm not gonna get anything right there either okay so I'm gonna leave that part alone now I'm gonna try with my fluorescent colors so right here bit of the fluorescent yellow and I'm going to come in with my fluorescent green and maybe I'll just do some of this turquoise blue as well and then take the bigger balloon 
and it's not wiped off yet. And I don't want to use up all my paper towels like I did before. So, just using my resources available, which is right now my apron. So, I'm going to go in right here. if that carries nope <laughs> just a little bit okay and I'm gonna go back in again with some of the fluorescent green then fluorescent yellow
that's the party. Finally, let me get my paper towel since I have run out of room on my apron. And hopefully this balloon does not pop from me rubbing it too much. Okay, so, ooh, I like that. I'm gonna go in with the fluorescent orange again. Not too much fluorescent pink. Then instead of doing the green, we may do the yellow. And let's see how this one turns out. Probably like that. Oh, that one is really nice. <laughs> Look at that. I hope you guys can see that. Let's see. No, nope, I'm not gonna get a redo. <laughs> what I do? I pick the towel. Okay. Let's try this silver mixture again. This is cadmium yellow plus 24 karat gold. Let's see how that one turns out. And then maybe I'll add a little bit of the fluorescent green. Okay, so here we go. Oh, that one's nice too. Just wish that it would carry again. After I dip it the first time. <laughs> and let's see. Since we had try to put something right there. So we have the mixture of phthalo green and bright aqua green mixed. Then let's come in with the fluorescent yellow. how it turned out um, the difference of all the colors that I use 
and I wanted to show you guys why I like the uh, orange or the fluorescent orange the pink and the uh, fluorescent green mixed together once you guys see how this canvas turned out so I'd like for you guys to come on in and see and this is how it turned out now this is the reason why I like the orange the green and the pink mixture I'm not sure if you guys can see it but it looks like a fish and it looks like one of those really pretty fish as well so going around the canvas right here with several of our look at that several of our balloon dips look at how pretty that is it still turned out absolutely gorgeous. I love that too. But this is how it turned out. On this 12 by 16 canvas. Well, I would like to thank you guys so much for joining me on today's acrylic pouring video using our balloons, using all of these colors to create this wonderful 12 by 16 canvas. Thank you guys so much for joining me and for watching the video. I greatly appreciate it. As I always say before I sign out, number one, stay safe. Number two, stay blessed. And number three, last but not least, no matter what it is in this world that you are personally facing, decide and turn your pain and even your happiness into paintings. Thank you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Hi.